Hey, this is Elijah with the Oxygen team. And in this video, we're going to continue building out our WooCommerce site in Oxygen using Oxygen's WooCommerce integration. In previous videos, we designed our shop archive, which you can see here. And we also designed our single product template, which you can see here. Now, we're going to work on creating our cart, checkout, and my account pages. So when you finish setting up WooCommerce, it runs you through a wizard which creates these pages for you and they're tagged appropriately in the WordPress admin panel. And to style these, we just need to edit those pages directly. So let's go to the cart page first and let's edit that with Oxygen. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a section and this is just going to be a container for our cart element. And we're going to go to Advanced Background, and we're going to use the same background pattern that we've used on the other pages on the site. And we'll set the background size to Auto. And let's do an overlay of this mint cream with some opacity to bring it down. And then we are going to go ahead and click Add. And we're going to either search for cart, or we can go to WooCommerce and scroll down and find Shopping Cart. And let's drop that in. Now that looks pretty good by default, but we're going to go ahead and make a few adjustments to this. Let's go ahead and add some uh, border radius to our images. And we'll do eight pixels here. And that just gives us a nice softer corner. Now let's go back and let's go to our links. And these are already styled appropriately because of our global WooCommerce settings. So let's jump into those really quickly and see if there's any adjustments we should make there because they can save us a lot of work. Uh, so manage settings, global styles, WooCommerce. And let's look at links. So we have our standard link color. Uh, and then I think most of our links need to actually be this red color when we hover over them. So now when we hover over these, they've got this red color. Uh, we might want to remove the text decoration, so we'll do this on the left-hand side since there isn't a global setting for that. Now, let's go to our buttons and make sure these are set correctly. Yeah, they look good. Uh, these secondary ones, we might want to adjust, but we won't do that just yet. Uh, the tertiary CTAs, let's go ahead and put these in line with the other uh, buttons. And then on hover, we're going to do this darker green color. Perfect, let's save that and then let's jump out of the global styles and let's just work with this element. So we're gonna jump over here and we're gonna go 14 pixels with the on the link size. And then on, we wanna go back to prices and we're gonna set these to 20 pixels, just a little bit bigger. Okay, so now we have everything pretty much styled up to fit our design. And that's pretty much all there is to setting up a cart page in Oxygen with the WooCommerce integration. As you can see, there are a lot of other customizations. So if you needed to change more to get this thing to look correct with your design, you definitely can. You have the power to do that. But for this particular design, this looks pretty good. So let's save that. And then let's jump back over to another page. So we'll go back to WP and click Admin. And then go to Pages. Now our checkout page will be the next one we'll do, so we'll click that and hit edit with Oxygen. All right, now we're on our checkout page. We're gonna do the same thing we did before and add a section and go to advanced background, background image, choose that image, auto for the background size and then overlay color, transparent mint cream. Now we need to click add and go to WooCommerce and look for the checkout element. And again, because of our global styles, most of this already looks pretty good, but we are going to make some adjustments here. Let's jump down to labels and let's change the label color to this dark green. That might look kind of nice. Plus they were a little bit light by default. Let's adjust the font size. Whoa, yeah, let's bring it down 14. That'll be good. And then let's go over to headings and let's set those to this dark green as well. And let's look through and see what else we want to adjust. So we want to go down here, prices and quantity. Uh, these should probably be 20 pixels because that's what we used elsewhere. And then let's go back 
and look at what else we have secondary buttons primary buttons info messages payment methods all of that great stuff but i think this is actually good enough for the uh checkout page so again these elements make it very easy to quickly get a nice looking page set up for cart checkout and my account and speaking of my account let's jump back to wp admin and let's go to pages and let's jump into my account let's click edit with oxygen And we'll do our setup here. We're going to add a section, advanced background, background image, choose the pattern, background size auto. We're going to choose mint cream for the color with about 80% opacity. Now let's go to add WooCommerce and look for our my account element. And on this one, because of our global styles, we don't actually need to make any adjustments at all. But what we might want to do for this section is we might want to go ahead and go to advanced size and spacing and set its minimum height to 100 viewport height. So you don't have that white space there at the bottom. Great. Let's save that and jump over to the front end and see what we have. All right. There's our My Account page. It will show us everything we need to know. I'm not going to click the log out button, though, because it will log me out. And then uh, let's look at checkout, which we just designed and styled up. Looks good. And let's look at our cart. It looks great. So now we have a complete WooCommerce site set up, including the shop page and the individual product pages and all of the pages you need for your customers to have access to, like my account, checkout, and cart. Again, this is Elijah with the Oxygen team, and that's how to set up the My Account, Checkout, and Cart pages in Oxygen with WooCommerce and Oxygen's WooCommerce integration. Thank you for watching.